Have you ever wondered what it would be like to upload your mind, your thoughts and all that makes you, you onto a computer? Scientists are seriously thinking about this idea. So let's take a journey into the world of uploading consciousness. But first, let's understand what actually the consciousness is. Consciousness is the state of being aware of and able to think about oneself, surroundings and experiences. It involves thoughts, feelings, perceptions and self-awareness. Consciousness allows us to recognize our existence and our interaction with the world. Now imagine if we could take all of that and turn it into digital data like pictures or music on your phone. One big question is how would we even start? Scientists suggest scanning every single tiny detail of your brain. Imagine taking a super detailed picture of your brain capturing every connection between neurons. It's like making a super detailed map of your brain's highways and byways. Once we have this incredible map, we could theoretically recreate your brain in a computer. Every thought and every memory that makes you unique all is stored in lines of code. But here is where things get really tricky. Would this digital version of you really be you? Would it have your feelings, your personality? Or would it just be a copy, like a clone in a sci-fi story? Some people argue that even if we could upload our consciousness, it wouldn't be the same as actually being alive. They say there is something special about our bodies and brains working together, something that cannot be replicated in a computer. Others are more optimistic. They think that if we could upload our minds, we could live forever. No more worrying about getting sick or old. Just transfer yourself into a new body or even live in a virtual world. But hold on a minute. What about ethics? Imagine if only rich people could afford to upload their minds. Would that be fair? And what if something goes wrong during the upload process? Would you still be you or would you be lost in digital limbo? So, while we might not be uploading our minds anytime soon, it's exciting to think about the possibilities. Who knows, maybe one day we will be chatting with digital versions of ourselves. Thank you for watching.